Hello, my name is Rachel from Ladle by Ladle, and I am coming at you today from my parents' house in the great state of New Hampshire. And I thought while I'm here with my parents, it would be an appropriate time to talk about how to tell your parents if you think you have an eating disorder. I remember when I did this, I was away at school in New Orleans and I had to have the conversation over the phone with them. My parents were very supportive and understanding in ways I could have never dreamed despite the fact that they were hundreds of miles away from me. I remember how anxious I was and how difficult I expected the conversation to be. It's never easy to confide something so personal in someone, especially as a teenager, to your parents. You may be worried that they're going to get angry with you and they won't understand. Or if you're like me, you'll just be embarrassed and worried that you're disappointing them in some way. Those are all normal feelings. But deciding to confide in your parents is one of the bravest and best decisions you can make while you're on this journey towards recovery. Chances are, they probably already have an idea of what's going on. Before you start this conversation, make sure that you find a time where nobody will be interrupted in a space that is quiet. Take a deep breath or do whatever you need to do before the conversation to completely calm yourself down and quiet all of the nerves that you're going to have before this conversation. Be prepared for any response. Denial, anger, misunderstanding, these are all reactions that you may be met with. However, please remember that if this is the reaction you receive, it does not invalidate your struggles. In these moments, it's best to have literature to share with your parents to help them understand a little better. Be patient and allow them to ask very basic questions as they try and understand what you are trying to explain. Be honest about your experiences no matter how embarrassing they may be. Your parents need to hear this to properly understand and to help support you going forward. If you have a plan of action for your recovery in mind, make sure to tell your parents so that they can help support you, whether that's just emotionally or also financially. Your parents or parental figures love you. They raised you and they will support you because they want what's best for you. This could be the first time they're hearing firsthand about some of these disorders. Try not to get defensive or argumentative as this is not a very effective way to get them on board with you. And believe me, I know how difficult that is. As an only child, I can get really whiny and arguey but this is not the time or place. This is a very serious matter and you want them to take you seriously. So try to avoid those kind of reactions. To summarize, plan a good time and place. Breathe deeply and calm your nerves. Be respectful of your parents' perspectives. Have information and materials at the ready to help them learn and understand and explain your plan of action or ask for their help in creating one. Good luck, you got this. And if anyone out there has their own experience with telling their parents about their own eating disorder or own struggle with their own mental health or physical health, please feel free to share it down in the comments. It might be really helpful for someone else to read about. As always, have a lovely day. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up or a share and make sure you subscribe to my channel. Still trying to do Vlogmas despite the complications with my camera and not being in my own home. Um, have a lovely day. Merry almost Christmas and I will see you tomorrow.